Hey friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a Walmart fall floral haul for you guys. I also picked up a couple things that I wanted to show you um, because sometimes you can find really amazing things at Walmart on clearance. And um, I'm just going to give you a little bit of a rundown how I want to do this. So I have a bunch of fall florals and a few different that are not exactly fall but you can use them for fall um, florals from Walmart. Now I went through all of my florals from Dollar Tree and I picked out the picks that way I could kind of show you to compare and contrast and then I will let you know what I personally think if Dollar Tree is the winner or if Walmart is the winner. Now again, I don't have every single thing that is the same to be able to compare, but if I can compare it, then I will. So I have my Walmart app pulled up here. What I'm gonna do is when I show you guys the pick, first I'm gonna scan it and then I'm gonna tell you what it is, show it to you, and then I'll show you the price. If I have a Dollar Tree comparable pick, then I will compare it and we will go from there. So I hope that I, ex I hope, <laughs> I hope that I explain that correctly and clearly. And with all that being said, if this is the type of video that you like, please give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. I also do a lot of Dollar Tree DIYs. That is what I mainly do on this channel, but I have been adding in some extra content to number one, get to know you guys a little bit better and you guys get to know me a little bit better. Also, I just enjoy putting out content. I enjoy talking to you guys and I enjoy just being on YouTube, period. So, with all that being said, I'm going to start off with the first um, bunch pick, whatever you want to call it. So, I'm going to scan it. This is called a maple leaf bush. So, if you didn't know, if you have the Walmart app, you can scan the tag and it will tell you if this leaf gets out of my way. You can scan any tag, even in the store. Like if you don't know how much it is or whatever, you can go right to your Walmart app. You can scan the tag and it gives you all the information. So this is a Mainstays Harvest 18 inch tall artificial tan maples, maples tree leaf bush. Huh, that's interesting. And it is $3.47. And you guys, the first moment when I walked into my Walmart's floral section, this caught my eye immediately because look at the gorgeous colors. That mauvey pink, that beautiful golden yellow. It's got very thin or very fine glitter all over it. I don't know if you can see that. But it doesn't make a mess. Like I can go like this and there's nothing falling. So I definitely like that. Now, this is the one from Dollar Tree and this is the pumpkin maple. Oh my goodness, you guys. Pumpkin maple. And I do believe that Dollar Tree is the winner here because this has one, two, three, four, five individual picks. Now, there's only two on each, whereas this one has four on each. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's ten stems on this. So, I do think that Dollar Tree is the better deal, even though this quality is amazing and the colors are on point. I feel like these look a little bit more high-end than these do, 
However, this is definitely a better deal. You get these little berries and pumpkins on this one. So yeah, this one takes the cake as far as these two. Okay, so along the lines of the um, like maple leaf bush, um, this is also $3.47 because it's basically the same thing, just different colors. It also has more chunky glitter on it, so this glitter does fall off all over the place. Um, I'm not a huge glitter fan for that reason, but if you don't mind glitter, I believe that in this particular color, this one is actually a better deal, and I'm going to tell you why. So you get one, two, you get 12 stems on this one. And these each have four, some of them have six. There's little teeny baby ones at the top to make it look more realistic. So, as far as this color, I do believe that this is the better deal. Number one, for the quality. Number two, for the attention to detail because it has these little ones at the top which emulate a real maple leaf tree or whatever. Maple tree, I should say. Yeah, maple leaf tree. Good Lord. And just the colors are very vibrant and beautiful. So, in my personal opinion, this one takes the cake if you were to compare these two. So for another $2 and some change, you get this instead of this. So again, this is all my personal preference. Um, if you have a different preference, that's totally up to you. But for me, this is the better deal. Okay, guys, sorry. Moving on. So this is a mum bush from Walmart. It has one, two, three. Five pretty large mums on them. If you pluck them off, you can put them on wreaths. So let's just see how much they are. They are mainstays 18 inch tall artificia flower stem cream mum bush with green leaves. Now I don't have a comparison for these. I'm not a big mum fan so that's why I usually don't pick them up at Dollar Tree but I will say that I have seen the mums at Dollar Tree and Dollar Tree is definitely a better deal because although these are extremely beautiful and big I feel that for $3 and around 50 cents, if you have tax more, I don't have tax in my state. So when it says $3.47, that's exactly what I pay for it. But I do feel that Dollar Tree is a better deal if you like mums. So definitely check your Dollar Tree. They have a ton of them right now. The next one that I picked up is a mum and rose pick. Now, I don't have anything that's exactly like this, but I do have something that's um, comparable. So, this is Mainstays Rose and Mum Mixed Artificial Flower Pick Multi Cream and Orange, 97 cents. This impressed me because, okay, this is Dollar Tree's bouquet they call it and although it's not exactly the same it's the same idea so these ones on the dollar tree are kind of like i don't know they they're they're nice for a dollar but they're cheap looking and I do like these. I've never seen them last year, and I do like them because they have a little bit of greenery. They have the pumpkin and the pine cone, and then these little beaded, whatever they're called. I don't know what they're called. If you know what these are called, let me know in the comments down below because I never know what to call them. Come on, camera. There you go. Okay, so for the Walmart one, I was really impressed when I picked this up. So, it has this sort of like, I don't know, cattail looking, it's not a cattail, but 
That's what it reminded me of. It's got these other little uh, floral pieces is what I'm going to call it. It's got a rose, which that can be fluffed up a little bit. It's got a mum. It's got a little bit of orange eucalyptus. It's got these little grass stalks, whatever you want to call it. And then it's got a like ma couple of maple leaves that are also different colors. So, in my personal opinion, I'm going to spread it out so you can see it. The Walmart pick is not only cheaper, it's more high-end looking, and it's got more of a variety. So, in my opinion, the Walmart takes the cake on that one. Okay, here is another mixed mum bush. This is from Walmart. I'm going to guess. I think this one's like five bucks. Okay. This is the Mainstays 19 and a half artificial cream orange mum bush. Oh, I was wrong. Three forty seven. And it has a lot more than the last mum bush. One, two, three. This one has 11 on it. And I personally think that this is a good deal. They look much more realistic than the ones at Dollar Tree. They have a variety of colors in one bush, I guess. And the greenery at the bottom is beautiful. It's got different colors in it. So me personally, I would choose this one over the Dollar Tree ones. Now, you can always pick up like three of the different colors um i guess if you wanted to but i personally think that these look more high end and for a couple dollars more you get a better look you get more of a variety and i would choose this one okay moving on to the dahlia mix now I believe they put these out for fall. I don't really know you guys because I did not see them before. And I'm at Walmart, sadly, multiple times per week. And I check that section every single time I'm there. And prior to them putting out the rest of this stuff, I did not see these. So, I'm thinking that they're for fall, but don't quote me on it. So, let's scan it. Now, these are $5, and I I have mixed feelings because I don't mind spending money on quality items that I feel is a good deal, and you're still staying on a budget. A lot of people think that because Dollar Tree items are a dollar, that it's always the best deal, and that's just not the case. You can have a dollar item from Dollar Tree that looks like I wouldn't spend five cents on it. And then you can go to Walmart and spend 97 cents on a comparable product that just looks more high-end. So I did just want to preface I did just want to preface by saying that because I know that there's mixed feelings and sometimes absolutely you get a better deal from Dollar Tree, but sometimes you don't. So that's why I have mixed feelings about this. You get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten um, stalks. And each of them have two layers of leaves. So it looks like you get two of the big dahlias. You get three of the peonies. And you get three of the, I believe these are magnolias. And then you also get a little bit of hydrangea. You get some extra greenery. You get some eucalyptus. Um, I think this is a good deal for five bucks. If you went to Hobby Lobby, this would probably be $15. So I personally think that this is an amazing deal. 
it looks high end the flowers look realistic the greenery looks realistic and it again was only five bucks so me personally i think this is a great deal trying to show you guys the whole thing so let's do it this way so this is the dahlias this is the hydrangea and the greenery this is the magnolia And when you do it, you can fluff them up, like I said before. They get kind of like bunched up from being in the box and stuff. This is the peony. Actually, this one looks better. With the greenery on it. So yeah, I, I think this is gorgeous and <laughs> You guys wanted me to do that like maroon and like mauve color themed fall video. So maybe I will do something with these for that video. So let me know in the comments down below if you want to see that type of video as well. Because I did get a few comments that a few people did want to see it. But I just want to make sure that it's something you guys want to see before I put it out. Now... In, I've never seen anything comparable to this at Dollar Tree. If you've seen anything, let me know. I would love to see that um, because I would pick up a bunch of it if I seen it. Now, I feel that this isn't... I mean, I guess they call it the same thing, so I guess... This is comparable, but I don't know, you guys. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So, this is supposed this is named a eucalyptus. Now, there's tons of different types of eucalyptus. Um, I never knew that before. I thought that there was just like one type of eucalyptus. So, let's scan it and see what it says. So this is called the Mainstays Artificial Eucalyptus Long Stem Solid Gray Green 41 Inches. And this is $3.88. And I believe that this is a great deal. Because, again, if you go to Hobby Lobby and buy this, you're going to spend probably $12. And... Yeah, you can use a coupon, which still Walmart's is cheaper. So, now I do have eucalyptus from Dollar Tree. All right, you guys, I got to put this hair up. I love you guys, but I just cannot. I can't handle it. You guys want a messy bun tutorial? So, just kind of fluff your hair up flip it over okay yeah you guys I have so much hair look at it and since my girl Nat sent me this new shampoo and conditioner oh my god you guys my hair looks so amazing I just love it so much <laughs> I'm being funny if you guys didn't catch on all right, so you just kind of want to pull your ponytail. No, that's not how I do it. Dang it. What am I doing? All right, so I kind of pull it off to the side. And then... I don't know if you guys can see this. So then I tuck this back because I can't see in hair all in my face or on my neck. Then I just pull the rest through. And 
Then, because I have so much hair and it wants to fall down, I take a clip and I pop a clip in the back to kind of hold it up. All right, I can't really see. Let me see what that looks like. Oh, girl, I look good, huh? Yeah, girl. I look good, girl, don't I? Oh, my God. All right. I can deal with that. All right, back to the haul. Sorry, you guys. It's hot. It's 95 degrees here today. And although I have an air in my she shed, when it's humid, it, like, doesn't want to work right. So, anyway. So, like I said, I think this is the better deal. Look how detailed these are. Look at a close-up at that that leaf the detail in the leaves sorry i know my camera's having a hard time but it's just beautiful it's got beautiful color in it and it's tall i mean here's the floor and i mean it's it's definitely 41 inches for sure Okay, so this is the Dollar Tree Eucalyptus. And although they stepped their game up this year, this is pretty good quality for a dollar. I am not complaining at all. I think this is an amazing deal. However, when it comes to quality and looking high end on a budget, this definitely takes the cake for sure. This was one of my favorites that I found. This is a wheat bush. This is the Mainstays 22 and a half artificial floral natural wheat bush. Once again, this was 347. I could have swore I picked up some wheat from Dollar Tree and I cannot find it anywhere. I'd lose my butt if it wasn't attached. <laughs> that is a fact. So, I don't know you guys I loved this as soon as I seen it I picked up a few of these because I think it's an amazing addition to your fall decor wreaths anything fall related this is perfect for that it's got the real like stock material it's got the faux um like new wheat I guess I don't really know because when wheat is grown up they're a little bit thicker than this so this is kind of like young wheat which I really like I think it just looks extremely high end and I mean you guys maybe I'm crazy but I feel like three dollars and fifty cents is an amazing deal compared to Michael's Hobby Lobby you know, high-end stores like that, this definitely takes the cake for me. So, I love these. Um, like I said, I picked up a few, and I might need to pick up a few more. Let me know in the comments down below. If you guys have seen the Dollar Tree wheat, do you like this wheat better, or do you like the Dollar Tree wheat better? I also think it would be nice to combine the Dollar Tree wheat with this wheat to kind of get a variety of like the bigger wheat stems, the baby ones. Like I think that would look beautiful. I am going to do a fall wreath video. I don't know if it'll come out. Um, I don't know when you guys are going to watch this, but hopefully I'm going to do that like ASAP. Okay, these were another one that caught my eye that I picked up a bunch of. Um, I just like the way they're shaped, and I don't know. I think you can make a beautiful wreath with this. Okay, so these are... See, this is what I'm talking about. This is a eucalyptus bush. I never seen eucalyptus that okay. looks like. So this is the mainstays. 21 inch artificial rust seeded eucalyptus bush now 
you guessed it, $3.47. I don't really have anything to compare, but I love it. I, I would pay $3.47 any day. That's just me personally. Again, please don't come at me in the comments saying that's not a good deal, blah, blah, blah. We all have our own opinions, as we know. And I personally think that this is a great deal. I was just at Michael's last week, and they had all the fall florals out. You guys, they literally, like, it blows me away, their prices. I would never in a million years buy anything at Michael's full price. And I wanted some stuff so bad, but it hasn't went on sale yet, at least since I've been there. And I I was like, nope, I'm not buying it until it goes on sale because the prices are ridiculous. I cannot believe anybody pays that. I don't care how much money you have. It's like throwing money down the drain, shopping at Michael's full price. I personally don't understand it, but again, that's just me. So I would 100% buy these. I'm going to go and hopefully get a couple more because I definitely want to make a wreath with this. Okay, now these, for a fact, I'm going to scan them, but I know that they are $5 or more because of how big they are. I have been shopping at Walmart for so long, and I've seen so many things that I can kind of just look at something, especially the florals, and know how much they are. And the bigger bouquets like this are always $5 or more. However, I still think that's a good deal. So let me scan it just to tell you the exact price. These are Mainstays Peony, Hydrangea, and Pumpkin Artificial Mixed Flower Bouquet Multi Cream 20 Inches, $5.82. Now, the reason why they're a little bit more than the other bigger bouquet is because look at these pumpkins on them, you guys. They've got the Buffalo Check Pumpkins as well as just a regular white pumpkin. They've The pumpkins have the really nice stems in them. It's got regular eucalyptus. It's got berries. It's got those things I don't know what the name of is. It's got green leaves. It's got maple leaves. It's got hydrangea. Did I already say that? I don't know. Um, it's got peonies. I mean, I definitely think this is an amazing deal. Um, you can make a centerpiece with this. There's so many different options. And the pumpkins are really good size. I mean, this is my hand. So they're about the size of my palm, which I believe is a great deal. So I definitely love these. I think the quality is on point, and they are definitely much cheaper than the high-end stores, like I've been saying, and I definitely love this. Okay, moving on. This is, this is what it looks like. This is the Mainstays 20-inch Artificial Red Maple Cattail Bush. $3.47. Surprise, surprise. And I don't know, you guys. This is a good deal. So let me kind of show you. I'm going to try to separate this. So you can kind of see all the different things you get in one pick for one low price. <laughs> All right, so hopefully you can see that a little bit better. So you've got a cattail, you've got these feathers or whatever it is. You've got leaves, you've got berries, you've got these things. Once again, I don't know what they are. Please somebody let me know what they are. 
you've got a pumpkin, you've got grass, you've got different color maple leaves. I love this. I think this is an, you've got a pine cone. I didn't even see that. Here is a bouquet from Dollar Tree. This is considered a bouquet as well. Which, obviously, you're not going to get anything like this at Dollar Tree. If you do, I would be totally shocked. Um, but, yeah, I obviously definitely think this is the better deal. This is the bouquet from Dollar Tree. What do you guys think? Would you pay a dollar for this one? Or would you pay $3 and some change for this one? I choose this one. Okay, here's one of my other favorites. Okay, so this might be an obvious one. This is not for fall. You can definitely use it for fall. You can use these all year round. I'm sure many of you have seen these, but I did just want to show you just in case you haven't. So these are the lamb's ear. These are one of my favorite, favorite things to pick up from Walmart. They're $2. I know that for a fact because I buy them all the time. I will scan it just to, just to be sure, but I buy them all the time. So you get two picks in one. They're extremely full, extremely high-end looking, extremely good quality. Mainstays, set of two, lamb's ear, short stem, solid, flocked, green, 15 inches, $2. That might be an obvious one because so many people use them, but I did just want to mention it in case somebody has never seen them or doesn't know. Definitely check your Walmart. This is an amazing deal. I love these. I have a ton of them. Okay, you guys. Moving on to the sunflowers. You get one, two, five sunflowers in one bunch. These are called Mainstays 19-inch Artificial Mixed Color Sunflower Bush. You guessed it. <laughs> $3.47. Now, I think this is a great deal because you can buy one of these on a clip at Dollar Tree for a dollar. And they're pretty much the same size. I don't have any on hand because I actually gave the ones that I bought away in the giveaway um, on my Dollar Tree haul a couple videos back. So I don't have any to compare, but I can tell you that they're almost exactly the same size. So for $3.47, you can get five huge sunflowers, whereas at Dollar Tree, the huge sunflowers are a dollar a piece. So in my opinion, this definitely wins the comparison race for sure. What do you guys think? Okay, now these are the yellow sunflowers. Three, four, five. I'm going to guess that they're the same price. However, I will check for you just to be sure because you do get five in this bush as well. These are the mainstays five head Five Heads Mixed Sunflower Artificial Flower Bush Solid Yellow, 18 inches. Yep, $3.47 um, each. So that's the yellow ones. Okay, so I did pick these up to compare. These are the Mainstays Eucalyptus. These are $0.97. Cents. They do sell longer eucalyptus. I have a ton of those. And those are 2 or $3, I believe, which I feel is a good price, um, obviously, because I have a bunch of them. And here is the Dollar Tree Eucalyptus. Here is the Walmart. So, you guys, I have to say, the Dollar Tree Eucalyptus wins. 
it's got more on it it's bushier the colors are extremely vibrant now I don't usually go for the vibrant colors like this I like the more muted it's more farmhousey to me but for fall these definitely win now on an everyday basis I would pick these over these just because of the color difference I haven't seen any at Dollar Tree that are this like muted green color so again personal preference but if we're talking about fullness Dollar Tree definitely wins okay you guys we're getting down to the wire we've got a couple more left I love these I love them I love them I love them that's all I'm gonna say these are a foliage bush they remind me of lamb's ear these are the mainstays 19 and a half artificial green flocked leaves bush three dollars and 47 cents okay look at these you guys look at these look how gorgeous I'm sorry I don't care who says it there's nothing at Dollar Tree that compares to this maybe I've never seen it before but I've been to a lot of Dollar Trees I've watched a lot of Dollar Tree hauls and I've never seen anything like this at Dollar Tree so I would pay three dollars and 47 cents for this any day of the week you get one two three four five stalks in one pick they're full they're high quality they look amazing i love these i will use these all year round as well as in fall so i picked up a ton of these just because i'm so afraid that they're not going to have them anymore usually at my store it's just like Dollar Tree. If you don't grab it when you see it, you're not going to see it again. So, I definitely love these. Run to your local Walmart and try to find these because it's definitely worth it. Now, this is also not a fall item, but you can use it at fall time, any time of the year. So, this is the Walmart... Um, Hampton Art Cotton Pick, $1.98. Now, they used to have them just like this. This is the Dollar Tree one. But now they have it like in this weird, I don't know. I don't really like the new ones. Okay, look at this. I don't really like it. That's just me. Now, look at the Dollar Tree one. I'm sorry, but the Dollar Tree one takes the cake on this one. Look at the difference, you guys. So, not only does this have more cotton on it, I like the fact that it's up instead of, like, separate, if that makes sense. Because these cotton stems... Here, let me show you. what These you can still, like... I think these look more natural than those do because you can kind of push them to each side and that is the way a natural cotton stem is it's not like this it's not like this so this definitely wins for me what do you guys think okay these are just little picks I picked up two of them because they caught my eye. I love them so much. I do believe these are 97 cents, but I'll check for you. So this is a mixed pumpkin pick. The pumpkin on it is really good size. I don't think you can really tell, but here's my hand, and there's the pumpkin. And these are Mainstays 12.75 artificial floral yellow pumpkin mixed pick 97 cents and again I'll just kind of compare this little pick I don't know you guys what do you guys think this looks more cheap to me than this does and this is 
less money than this one. I mean, the pumpkin is really tiny. The pumpkin on this one is very realistic. Now the stem needs to be pushed in a little better, but that is nothing I can't fix. This has actual real twigs on it, real um, corn stalks, berries, a leaf. I definitely think this one wins. So I picked up two of those. This is just a single pick. It is a hydrangea. Now, I do believe I've seen these all year long, but the color reminded me of fall, which is why I picked it up. And then I realized, I think I've seen these all year round. However, I would definitely still use it for fall. And this is the Mainstays Large Single Hydrangea Long Stem solid dark green 27 inches four dollars so this is a hard one for me because this is the dollar tree hydrangea and it's teeny teeny tiny like Now, you can buy four of these, and you would probably have the same, maybe a little bit less. I don't know, you guys. This is a hard one. I don't know. I don't know, you guys. That's a hard one. These have much bigger flowers to them. Like, I don't know if you can tell this, but look at this difference in the petals. Here we go. Look at the difference in the petals. These are much bigger, much fuller, and they're not as flimsy. So when it's on the pick, they stay open like hydrangea, hydrangeas do. Whereas on the Dollar Tree one, they're kind of flimsy. They close. So I don't know. I probably would pick the Walmart one, but... I think they're definitely like a close runner up. I don't know. I think you could probably get away with buying three at Dollar Tree. I don't know. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments down below because this one that this is one that really stumps me. I don't know which one is better. Okay, I'm really excited for these because these are new this year. I don't know, maybe they had them last year, but I've never seen them. And they look super, super realistic. Look at these, you guys. Look at that. The leaves look real, like I can't get over it. This is beautiful. <laughs> So this is a Mainstays Artificial Dried Look, Dried Look, Mainstays Artificial Dried Look, oh, okay, Large Sunflower Stem, $2.98. I think that's a great deal. You guys, look, this thing's the size of my head. Look at it. It's huge. The stem is really long, so if you have a nice little jar, you can stick this in there. It looks so real. Like, had I not bought it myself, I would have thought that it came out of somebody's garden or something. The colors, I love it. The leaves look like they're wilted. I'm impressed with this, you guys. And I'm not, I haven't seen anything comparable to it at Dollar Tree. So these are kind of on along the same lines of that like real looking dried look. So here's this one. I think these are a little bit cheaper. Mainstays artificial dried look sunflower stem yellow. Yeah, these are a dollar ninety eight. Look how realistic they are. I cannot get over it. So this one I say, you guys, 
I know that you see a dollar and you're like, oh my God, what an amazing deal. I can buy whatever I want. But sometimes if you just spend a couple more bucks, if you have it, the quality is just on par. Like it really is. So I don't mind spending money on quality things. If I spend my money on something that's not quality, then I won't buy it. But if it's quality and it's going to last and it's a good product, I don't mind, you know, splurging a little bit because the saying goes that you get what you pay for and it's 100% the truth. So I definitely love these and I'll probably pick up a few more. Now this is exactly the same. It's just a different type of flower and a different color. I'm going to scan it just for good measure, but I believe this is a dahlia. Okay, so this is a mainstays artificial dried look dahlia stem cream again $1.98. I love this as well, you guys. I'll probably pick up some more of these. I think it's a great deal. They're gorgeous. They're high-end looking, and I definitely love these. So, I actually have... Well, I guess I don't. I thought I had a Dahlia to compare from Dollar Tree, but no, I don't. So, I guess you can kind of compare. Even though this is a little bit different, you kind of get the same idea. Um... One of these stems is about the size of this. Or one of these whole picks, I should say. Like, look. So, in my personal opinion, if you need a bunch, definitely go with, like, Dollar Tree because you get, you might get more on the stem. But for me, I would probably put this in a vase, like, on my table or whatever, like I said. So I would definitely probably go with this. Before I go, I wanted to show you this. Now, I thought I grabbed a couple things, but I guess I just grabbed um, two of, I guess I just grabbed two of the exact same things. So just like any other store, whenever a season is going out and a new season is coming in, they obviously have things on sale, whatever, whatever, and that is my favorite time to shop. So I picked up, look how big these are. I don't know if you can tell, but this is, it just says porch decor. It was $18.88, so almost $20, and it is three foot three foot by eight around eight and a half inches this is perfect for um like porch leaners and it's got the hardware in the back for it to stand up if you don't have anything to um like lean it up against so you can't really tell but um i'll i'll lower you down here in a minute and show you but it's got the thing in the back so what I was thinking is I could just unscrew this use this to do a sign and just screw this onto the back side because this says summer porch rolls summer and these letters are raised so I don't know I might be able to pop them off and save these letters like I said when seasons go out and new seasons come they just want to get rid of this stuff so i'm sure you can even go to the manager and like like this one has a little scratch on it i could say this is messed up can you mark it down even more the worst they can say is no so what do you have to lose nothing really so anyway um yeah, so that was the, that's what I wanted to show you. I thought, like I said, I thought I had a couple things, but I guess I just picked up these signs. So definitely amazing deal. Okay, so if you see this pulls out, it's just like a metal bar. 
and then you can just lean it back if you don't have anywhere to like lean it up against and it's just going to be like free leaning so I thought that was really cool even if I don't use it I can keep it and maybe use it on something else that wraps up this video you guys I hope this was fun I had so much fun making this. I thought it was fun to kind of compare and see the different options from Walmart to Dollar Tree. Sometimes Dollar Tree is the better deal. Sometimes it's not, and that's okay, you guys. Dollar Tree is not the end-all be-all. I know that's really sad to hear, but it's the truth. So, anyway, with all that being said, I know I don't have my little helper here today. I actually got a little bit of a break. Yay me. So I wanted to get this out to you ASAP, which is why I did it while the kids are gone. Because if the kids are here, I'm in and out. I have to stop and go, stop and go. So it was fun to just sit down, go from start to finish with you guys. And yeah, so let me know in the comments down below. Do you enjoy this type of video? Do you not? Whatever the case may be, let me know in the comments down below. And per usual, if nobody has told you today, you are absolutely amazing, you are worthy, and I love you with all my heart and soul. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye!